In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys the new XP lobby glitch on Cold War. And we're going to be doing this on Team Deathmatch, which means you can get 100 kills. The way we're going to get 100 kills is we're going to go ahead and do a Team Deathmatch lobby instead of the SMD lobbies that we see. And we're going to be doing this on Outbreak. And the, all the camo stick, as well as the first category, does count as well. And this will help you get your dark matter on all your weapons. So this is pretty much like the go-to XP lobby glitch on Cold War right now. I've seen a bunch of people doing it on Free For All and for SND. But the problem was that for Free For All, you can only get 30 kills a game. So just imagine you have to redo it over and over about, let's say, just 10 times just to get 300 kills. Rather than doing this three times on TDM and you get it the 300 kills. So so this glitch lobby is better in my opinion. I haven't seen many people do it. And on top of that, the SND lobby, it wasn't sticking. Like the camos weren't sticking on the first for the first category. So I'm not here to say that the SND lobby doesn't work. But just for me, in my experience, it wasn't sticking. So... It, it's not the way for me, but but I'm going to stop talking now. I'm going to stop explaining. Let's get straight into this video. So I would really appreciate, before we do, go ahead and leave a like and subscribe and turn on the bell notification so you guys know when I post new glitches and anything Call of Duty related. I really appreciate it. These videos do take me some time to do, so I appreciate you guys. And once I hit a thousand subs, I'm gonna be doing a giveaway, so stay tuned for that. Um, you'll see in the ca in the comment section, I'm asking every video whether you guys are Xbox players or PSN. So let me know down in the comment section below. And finally, let's get straight into this new XP lobby glitch. So for this glitch, we're gonna be needing two players. So okay, so to start this glitch, player two needs to be in the multiplayer bots lobby. Now player one then needs to invite player two. And once we've done that, player two is going to go ahead and accept that. Once player two gets the invite and joins, they're going to want to press the settings button and go into the settings. Now for player one, they're going to go ahead and bring the lobby, like leave the lobby so that they're in the main menu. Then player two is going to go ahead and press the settings button again. And now player one's going to go ahead and move over to zombies. Now, once player one changes to the zombies lobby, you're going to see this happen for player two. Now, when you see this screen, this means you're doing it correctly. Player two is doing it. You guys are doing it correctly. If you see this screen for player two, all player two is now going to do is move, move the selection down to change map. So they're ready for the next step. So now they got to wait for player one to do the next step. Now, player one's going to go ahead and start a private outbreak match and once player one has seen that the game has started they're gonna go ahead and leave the lobby now they're gonna go ahead and join player two once player one has joined back on player two all player two has to do is change the map to wherever and put it on team deathmatch and they're gonna back out one time go to the social menu which is triangle or Y. I'm pretty sure and you're gonna go ahead and leave the party. And player two screen is gonna stay looking just like that. And player one is gonna see that it changed to team deathmatch on Golova, as you see here, or to whatever map they, they've chosen. And then you're gonna go ahead and just start the game. Player one will see now that the map has changed and it's on team deathmatch now. You guys will both see that when the game is starting that you guys are still together but you guys are not because when player two leaves the lobby it switches the teams so make sure you do the leave party screen if you're player two make sure you're leaving the lobby before the match starts because if not you guys will spawn on the same team and you guys are going to go ahead and once you get into the game you guys are going to spawn in some random locations all you have to do is go ahead and both of you are going to go ahead and kill yourselves. And once you do that, you guys will be spawned in to the map center. And you're going to see that you guys can go ahead and just kill each other easily. 
and everything's gonna count. Super simple, super easy. And that's basically the glitch right there. And you see here, you could do long shots, behind cover kills. There's plenty of objects that player two can sit behind if he needs to go for the behind cover kills. You can do this with two controllers, by the way. I wouldn't really advise it. It's not as easy. If you have a friend that just, you know, he plans to get off, it's easier to do it that way. But you can do this with two controllers. And all, all you have to do is this is just a normal team deathmatch. Go ahead, get your kills, get the, you know, get the camos you need. Super simple, super easy. Go ahead and get that dark matter. This is the best XP camo lobby out right now. And you could do it on Outbreak. Better than the SND one. Better than the free for all. Not only on this glitch do you unlock the category camels, but you also level up your gun, which is why it's an XP lobby glitch. And honestly, it's great for those of you that that are like me that really don't play Black Ops that much and want to get your guns leveled up for Warzone or something. I think this is the easiest way to do it. Or, you know, we all, not gonna lie, we all want the, those camels. So go ahead and grind out those camels. It's the best, the best thing you could do with this glitch. Get them camels. So... I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope it was straightforward and to the point. I hope you guys understand it. If you guys have any questions, go ahead, comment down below. I'll be helping all of you guys out. If you want, you guys can go ahead and DM me questions as well. You guys see my links on the bottom of the screen. I really appreciate it. Go ahead and leave a like if you enjoyed this content. If you find it useful, I'm really pushing out this content for you guys. So please go ahead, leave a like. While you're at it, also subscribe if you're new. Welcome to the channel. I'm TJ Kumas. I post lots of Call of Duty content. So go ahead and hit that bell notification if you want to be notified for anything Call of Duty related or Call of Duty glitches. I also do other games, so be aware of that. I like to dabble a little bit into new games. I have a couple series on the channel, so I'd really appreciate if you take your time and go ahead and check them out. Just like my 2K, my 2K NCAA series and my Strange Brigade series, which is a game I don't think many of you know about. And also, when you subscribe, you are being a part of the 1,000. So once we reach 1K, I'm going to go ahead and give away some gift cards. So, you know, go ahead. Subscribe if you want that giveaway and I really appreciate you guys <clears throat> I really want to say thank you guys for just supporting me. It really means a lot and I hope you guys have a good one I'll see you guys on the next one peace Together, so I can get to know you a little better. I know you chat to your club about me. You let to see me when I pop up in the room round three. I think we should start a close room together, so I can get to know you a little better. I know you chat to your club about me. You let to see me when I pop up in the room round three. I know you see me, baby. You hear the way I talk that shit like I'm on TV, baby. You got a room about relationships and demons daily. I seen your caption at the top. You and your feelings lately. I love the way you PTO. The picture drive me crazy. It's probably overdue, but I'm just thinking to myself, let's get a private room. Yeah, I'm trying to fuck with you. I'm a pinging one, so you can keep it real too. I think we start a close room together, so I can get to know you a little better. I know you chat to your club about me. You let to see me when I pop up in the room round three. I think we should start a close room together.